Hey guys, it's Tash and I've been to Primark again, so we got another Primark haul. I went last month, I wasn't really expecting to find a lot, but you, they constantly are bringing in new stuff and I never know when I'm going to be able to find loads of things or buy anything. There was quite a fair few things, um, I tried on quite a few stuff but didn't buy it, but I bought some nice items and I'm going to show you now. Well first off, these are Christmas lights, it's 40... Um, little miniature multicolored LEDs. These aren't, I haven't bought these for Christmas. Now, I haven't done a whole video of them. I mentioned in, like, I think my monthly favorites that I've got some nice little white fairy lights around my shelves and some white ones going along my wall. Now, I kind of, in a way, I didn't know wherever I wanted them to go on the top of my wall, I got my posters like they are currently. Wherever I wanted to pin them, go around the bottom. So now I bought these, so these will go around the top and then the white ones I'm going to like pin around my wall. And yeah, so I bought some little colour bugs, I thought that makes it a little bit different, have some nice colour in there. Although it's probably going to feel a bit Christmassy with coloured ones, but I don't know, maybe if I put them up now, see how it is. If I don't really like having them up when it's not Christmas, I may just take them down and just have them be Christmas ones. Then I also f saw these, and I don't really know where I'm going to put these, but they're so cute. It's these little red reindeer lights, there's 20 of them. Yeah, I just thought they were really cute, so I'm sure I will find somewhere to put them because I've always, there's always places I can just hang a few lights, I think. Now this one, I thought it was so cute. Now I have a candle on my desk, which I've mentioned my candles in many like favourites and hauls before. Now this one I thought was so cute. It's just a simple purple candle, but it's got this like little wreath around it with all these little like sparkly um, little balls on it, and it's just so nice. And I thought it would just look perfect for Christmas, like with you could light the candle in the evening, and it just looks so nice. And then it also looks nice in the day, like my candle in the day is a bit boring, it's just a jar with a little knit and it's a purple thing inside. This one actually looks nice whether it's lit or not. Now I don't buy shoes a lot, but I saw these in there and I fell in love. And the only problem is, is I'm here thinking, am I ever going to wear them? They're the kind of shoes that would probably look really nice with jeans, but I always feel like they'd look weird. I don't know, but they look would look great with like tights and stuff. I couldn't help myself because they're just pretty amazing. It's these here. And then just love the pattern. It's just the only problem is I didn't, wouldn't want to wear them with something where I've got a huge pattern on the top. I'd have to be something plain. Um, I'm going to see if it maybe looks okay with the outfit I'm wearing today. Because you never know, sometimes it could look okay. I just love the like bright colours and the flowers on them. I just thought they look really great. And if I got like a simple outfit, it would just look great having like a nice crazy shoe. I'm very annoyed because if you see my Maslan haul where I bought some a choker set. Now I'm loving chokers and I've really wanted to have like... Choker, like one of the tattoo chokers on my neck, one like this, like a short or, or a chain one, just like really short, like low on my neck, and then maybe a longer one. And they had them in Mastelan, but they were ten pounds, and with my with my staff discount, it cost me seven pounds. But I still thought that was quite pricey because I was buying them for like like one pound, two pound on like eBay. But anyway, I knew that Primark was, if they ever had them, they'd have them really cheap and I thought surely they'd have them. But at the time when I went, they never had any. Bloody typical. Now I've spent seven pound on them, they have them in Primark. So not only do they just have this little cute one, so yeah, they have this nice, nice little like pastel pink tattoo choker with this cute, really thin black one with a little flower and some gems on it. That was two pounds for that. So that's a pound each. Then they also had this one where it's got the tattoo choker with a little like flowery kind of thing on it. This nice little chain and then this one and that was three pounds so once again they were a pound each. And I'm so annoyed that I spent five pound on five and I spent seven on three. But then I love them so much that I kind of not complain. I really like my other set. These aren't like my other ones and so I just got to see it that way. So to say that I'm um, watching Mockingjay tonight, I've got a little bit OTT on the Mockingjays because I've got my Catching Fire shirt on and I've got my long Mockingjay necklace, my choker Mockingjay necklace and my Mockingjay bracelet on. Yeah, and they also looked crazy when I went to the cinema and the guy probably was thinking when I said two adults for Mockingjay, he's probably like, yeah, I'm not surprised. Right, so on to the clothes now. I didn't buy a lot of accessories, that's crazy for me, but I didn't actually have a very good thorough look at the accessories. I don't wear my like big cardigans a lot, but I have been wanting to wear them recently, and I've only got two. I've got like chunky knitted, like kind of, I would say cream, but it's not really creamy. It's kind of like a bit of sandy colour. That one with like navy patches on and stuff. And then I've also got a kind of like fluffy burgundy one. So I bought this nice kind of like grey-y, bluey, um, fluffy one. 
nice long one and I just really like it because it's nice and fluffy and I bought it in a 16 like my other one is because my burgundy one I wanted to get it in a 14 so it'd be quite big but then I never had a 14 so I got a 16 and I know that fits perfectly so I just bought this one in 16 I don't think they had a 14 actually anyway it'd be nice and toasty throughout the winter and this one I never tried on but I saw it and I just really love the colour and I've got one of these blouses anyway so I know it fit I've got a red one which I haven't even worn yet and I bought it back in like August it's just this really nice mint green blouse that I just I like blouses I know I haven't worn them much this year but I'm going to try and get some more wear of them throughout the winter and I just really like it because I just love the colour. The colour is absolutely gorgeous and I haven't got one like this colour. I saw this skirt and I thought it's really nice and I was like, do I get it? Do I get it? I wasn't sure. My friend was like, yeah, get it, get it, get it. And I'm really glad I did because it's just so cute. It's going to have a nice soft material. Um, it's just a simple little skater skirt and it's black with this cute little pattern on it. And it's just really nice and I love the colour. And what's amazing is that this would go so nice together. So I'm definitely going to wear that. I think I might wear it out for my meal with my friends on Sunday. Now, once again, as always, if anyone who knows, like, watches my videos and knows what I'm like with my Primark course, I always end up buying a men's t-shirt. I know I love Primark is that they have loads of, like, t-shirts, like, character t-shirts and, like, these with films and everything on and you just find something you love and you think I need that t-shirt and they had this in the men's and I couldn't say no like to start off it's galaxy print which is so cool but brace yourselves it's freaking toy story I don't even know if that's in shot but you know it's got Jesse I hate Jesse then there's Ham and Woody Woody's my favorite then there's Buzz and the aliens and the soldiers at the bottom Bullseye on the arm Zerg Slinky Rex more aliens and the only thing one thing I noticed is that where the fuck is Mr. Potato Head? Then last but not least a t-shirt that I have actually wanted for a while now. I've been seeing them online and I'm like oh my god I want that shirt. Oh my god it's amazing. It's covered in emojis. Oh my god look at it. How cool is that? Just all the emojis on there and I was actually finally able to show my mum the girl with the brown hair because it looks just like her and I was like I always say to her mum this looks like you but she's like I can't see it I'm blind and I could finally be like look there you are look my mum's on my t-shirt my mum is in emoji form why can't it be one of me so there that is everything um except for the bold santa there was a little bold santa if you go on my twitter at Tash Rainbow, you'll see a picture that I tweeted of a little bold Santa. I saw it and I was just wetting myself because it was just so funny and cute. And then when I got home, I was like, oh, I want it actually. And I don't know why I didn't buy it. Actually, my friend just messaged me. She's gone to Primark today because she said she was in town. I was like, oh my God, get me the bold Santa. I think she's got me one with a hat on, but it's okay, you can just cut it off. But um, I will see you in my next video. And yeah, so bye.